speaking of Idaho, which we do on this show, um, I saw an interesting stat this week. Idaho's mm-hmm. population growth is slowing down. Interesting. You are really into numbers this week, aren't you? I guess so. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Idaho's 44 counties saw 1.3% population growth, a more modest growth rate mm-hmm. compared to 1.8% in 2022. Right. And 3% in July of 2021. Right. When I feel like everybody was moving here after COVID. Right. The world went crazy. Mm-hmm. People discovered they could work from home. And they're like, where do we want to go? Someplace chill. Yeah. Well, someplace chill, someplace- But not too chill. Right. Can't smoke weed. (laughs) Yeah. Well, it's chill and it's also, you know, people sort of looked around and said, okay, well, if I can work from home, why don't I move somewhere that has a better cost of living, where I can have more land to myself? I don't have to be right stacked on top of folks. Quality of life. Yeah. Well, and speaking of sort of the quality of life of small towns, I think that this is sort of a nice little transition to your t-shirt there. Yes, it is. Thank you, Carly Morgan. (laughs) Yeah. So this week's t-shirt is available at tetontshirts.com. Um, it celebrates South Tourist Park in <laughs> Idaho Falls. Yeah. You may recognize this sign. Uh-huh. It says Idaho Falls uh-huh. in a certain sort of Western style font on a wooden sign. Well, and what a great shade of green that you've chosen for this one, too. Yeah. I think it's very on theme for the specific um, look that you're going for. It's a primary color. Uh-huh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Anyway, South Tourist Park, South, this, South, you might as well call it South Park. Uh-huh. is in Idaho Falls, right around the intersection of Sunnyside and Yellowstone. Mm-hmm. So if you like South Parks as much as I do, <laughs> you might like this t-shirt too, tetontshirts.com. <laughs> Certainly not representative of anything else that I'm aware of. Oh, no, no, nothing nothing I can think of. Also worth a mention, remember we've talked about how Idaho Falls is repositioning itself from a gateway to mm-hmm. adventure to a destination location. Right, which I think we are. Yeah, I think we are too. So they've changed the name of their little tourist center to the Visit Idaho Falls Experience. And along with that, Mm -hmm. this is the one located on River Parkway, Uh right across from the soon-to-be Old Water Tower Bench. Uh Uh-huh. Does that make sense? Okay. Yeah. Anyway. The water tower is soon to be the old water tower. The bench will still be there, but it'll yes. represent the old water tower. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> As part of the art you can sit on project yeah. that we have that's really cool. Mm-hmm. They're gutting the building and they're going to open it on April 12th. Oh, wow. Okay. Just coming up next week. So that'll be exciting. Nice. I didn't realize they were doing such a big transformation. That sounds fun. There was a fireplace in there that they're knocking out that they showed pictures of. Oh, wow. So that'll be cool. Just in time for tourist season mm-hmm. 2024. Nice. 